somebody got a little too close to my vehicle and busted my rear view. But that's not what here. <laughs> that's not what I'm here to talk to you about. It's an issue that's been on the national news, and of course, uh, it's one of those things that you can't help but have to interact with because it affects so many people. And I just wanted to kind of share my experience. Uh, I was talking with a co-worker and, and this person brought it up. I I didn't uh, I didn't initiate the conversation. Uh, but anyway, it's a regular day at the office and this person said, well, why do you even need an AR-15? And it just kind of sparked my interest. I just kind of let it go and that person kept talking about it and it's like look here I didn't say look here but it's like well let's put it this way why do you have two vehicles why do you have two houses um, why do you have a big house people in Ethiopia get by every day with just enough to eat to keep them alive that's all you need you need food you need water and some kind of shelter so everything else you have, you don't need it. So nobody needs an AR. So that kind of kills your argument right there. Why? Well, on the surface level, right? Just to kind of bust the argument of, well, why do you need this? Or why do you need that? You don't. You don't need any of it. We, uh, we substitute or we've normalized in our society things we want to make our lives more comfortable and and justify by saying I need it right I don't need this truck I can take the bus so that that was the first stage of the, of the discussion <clears throat> so then this person said well what do you hunt with it <laughs> and, and those of you who, who understand uh, out there, I, I can I can hear you shake your head right now. And so I just kind of calmly said, "Well, I don't hunt anything with it. Uh, in fact, I've never even shot my some of my guns. I have them because I can. It's a right." It has nothing to do with what I use it for. It's because I can. This person has, let's just put an off-road vehicle. And it's like, where do you go that's off-road in your vehicle? You have a vehicle that goes off-road. What do you, you know, what do you use it for? Why do you need that? Um, it, it, it's, it's such, it's such an old debate that should be over, but I guess when the media and the politicians use that argument enough and people refuse to look one layer beyond what the argument is or what the reasoning is to take guns away or to restrict gun ownership, uh, everybody just kind of believes it. So, I, I don't want to go on too long, <clears throat> but I, I just want to squash these two arguments right away. Very simple. One, it, it, without going into the whole governmental tyranny and, and all that, <clears throat> just, just crush the argument of why do you need it and uh, what do you hunt with it? <laughs> right? <laughs> to answer the first argument, I don't need it, I want it, but 
if that was the argument for everything that you own, you should have nothing. You should have a loaf of bread, a jug of water, and a lean-to. Because that's all you need to survive. Uh, so then, what do you hunt with it? Or why do you have it if you don't use it for its intended purpose? Well, who are you to decide what the intended purpose of an object is? <clears throat> you know, I have hammers and wrenches that just sit on my workbench until I need them, but I don't necessarily always use them for the perceived intended use. Right? I've used a wrench as a hammer. <laughs> uh, I've used lots of things that aren't for their intended use, but I've never killed anybody. Right? Um, you know, yes, guns kill things, but guns are all also recreational. And in the very, 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 hopefully, uh, unlikely event, uh, guns are de a, a deterrent against any threat. Any threat. Um, do bad people use guns? Yes. But bad people also use cars. Bad people also use gasoline. Bad people also use knives. Bad people use their fists. <laughs> so that's that's gonna do it uh, for now. And I don't know. Maybe we'll get into uh, a longer discussion about. Uh, and there's lots of, of discussions out there on what the true nature of gun ownership in America and rights and the Second Amendment uh, on YouTube. You can. Could research that all you want but uh, if, if you need a counter argument to the idiotic question of why do you need a gun or why do you need that rifle that can shoot 30 rounds uh, the argument is well then why do you need your vehicle why do you need fancy shoes why do you need more than one pair of shoes yeah. all right I think that dead horse is pretty well beat. <laughs> Later. <laughs>